got Van from Planet Earth. Nice to see you all. In the month of October 2016, we went on a journey through time and space. Up and down the UK, into Ireland. With you, me at six. We were a lovely set of lads. It was a lot of fun, wasn't it? It was great fun. We gotta stretch our vocals a little bit. You getting this? Yeah. Bad, bad vocal warm ups so that I don't even know if they're <laughs> beneficial to us as human beings. I get very excited just before we go on, I can't really control myself. the last, always. <laughs> Five seconds. Should we just do it? Absolutely perfect. <laughs> I wanted to play alongside such prestigious acts as Jack and the Beanstalk. <laughs> One Night of Queen, which Brian May said is something more than a likeness. Folkestone Model Railway Exhibition. Now we missed that. We went for a jog. Got in trouble for going for a jog, actually. Kind of worth it because it was like Venice Beach. Actually, my first four not focused in. One of our songs alone would never be able to justify the sheer beauty of the surroundings and the sunset. So I kind of used another artist to speak my words. And it was? The wonderful Sinead O'Connor. Oh, lovely. Seven hours and fifty days since you took your love away. Don't you know Nothing compares to you. Nothing compares. No, is that the same what stick you used for the. No, the it's the other end. I, I, I really, I'm quite new to them. Did you really? Yeah, mm -hmm. right. That's why they're yellow. Pint of tea. Not too close to stage yeah. time though, we've all made that mistake. You're going to enjoy that whiskey. Yeah. <laughs> journey to Ireland about halfway through the tour. I forgot my passport, oh, which yeah. was scary because I thought I was not going to be allowed in. But thankfully their security is terrible and they didn't <laughs> check any of our passports. So that was fine. So if you're going to try and smuggle in somewhere, I would uh, recommend Ireland. Any, any immigrants watching? 
Night of Dublin, we got Hottest Record with Peace and Love, which is wicked. Hello! Hottest record tonight and it comes from Vans and we have Matty on the line live from Dublin, my favourite place on earth. Have you had a Guinness? I haven't yet because I'm incredibly hungover <laughs> from Belfast. <laughs> we had our fifth consecutive Hottest record in the world. That's quite a sad song, but it's also very joyous at the same time, so thanks for making it your hottest record. Always a pleasure, an absolute pleasure, and we'll hear it now for the second time. Delphi. <laughs> oh, cameraman's got no arms. We got to piss on the newly elected president's face. I forgot about that. What? <laughs> yeah, guess what? The van got robbed. <laughs> <laughs> I just got in the van and I'm sweating. Like, guess what I forgot this morning? I forgot my bass. He's a brilliant man. I want to hear about his day. Yeah, he's, he's like, I mean this in the nicest possible way, he's like a great organised mess. He looks like the moon from the Mighty Boots. <laughs> the moon is mad, he's milky white, everybody look at the moon. Oh, eh, yeah. I did a song. The thing is though, when the sun <laughs> goes round me, I lick his back. And then look his back and Jupiter He has a fish finger as big as a garbage. <laughs> we are peace and love. We are Mother Nature when there is season. First ever cassette I ever owned. Please, please be by the Beatles. Elvis, a little less conversation, he was on a football advert. I think it was bad. I actually thought I was dreaming for a second. I thought I'd made this up. And you found it as well. There's evidence of the Smurf cover of yours. <laughs> Good to come back to the place that you call home, which is for us is London. We were all super excited about Shepherd's Bush Empire. You think of the prestige of that venue and all the yeah. people that have treaded those boards before you. And even though we were supporting, it was kind of an amazing experience to sort of be part of its history. Ball two was wicked for us and like, we were really thankful to the UMI at Six Boys for bringing us along. It's amazing being on tour and supporting. It just makes you really eager to to get back out and, and headline your own shows. The chance to play to our fans and give them a lot, like a big taste of the album. That's going to culminate in our biggest London show ever at Scala. It's the whole point of this tour is showing compassion and love, but simultaneously saying that we're not going to take this shit anymore. Our shows are the activism that is required to start this movement, so be a part of it.
so tall You know our love is all Hope had you stand so tall You know 